Hey, welcome to my channel, Run With Brad. This is Go Rook Light, Operation Red Wing. Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Run With Brad. It's about to get real. In front of me is the uh, Marine Reserve Training Facility. I'm in Smyrna, Georgia. I'm about to com or compete. I'm about to participate in my first Go Ruck Light event. It's Operation Red Wing, which is fitting because I got to see Marcus Latrell speak uh, a couple weeks ago, and it's going to be tough. People are starting to show up. All right, guys. Check in later. All right, show you what I got in my bag. Got to bring an Algene bottle, a bladder, and they encourage, or you got to bring your ID and $20 cash. I guess if you got to pay a cab, pick you up. In here, I got some Band-Aids and snacks, alcohol pads, and somewhere in here I have uh, hand sanitizer one thing that is required today is a mask which I have in this bag and also some gloves which I'll toss these in here I see document this. This log is heavy as shit. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I think we're almost back, but it is pouring down rain. We got a good system going though. We got six guys on this. Show you how dry the inside is. Pretty damn dry. All right, the Go Rug Light event is complete. I did it. It was hard. It was much harder than I ever thought it would be, but it was worth it. It poured down rain. What other way to make it more memorable 
than to stand in the rain and bond with people you don't do not even know got a really cool patch to represent operation red wings each each log that we carried represents one of the helicopters that crashed during that tragic day and we definitely honored those soldiers today i definitely want to do a tough i will say um just to go over some things that we did do today i i wasn't able to get everything we we did on film but most of it or pretty much all of it consisted of carrying a log who's gonna carry the boats in the log now when we got we got to a park and we did like a race kind of deal where we got split up into four new groups and we had to strap three rucks to the uh, log now most rucks have at least 20 mine i had a 30 pound weight but so we we got three rucks uh, strapped it to the log and we had to go around three times so each time we went around we got to take a rucksack off and i didn't know it but the log that we had was the heaviest log apparently it was one that's still drying out and it was not honestly when we got to the last one and we had to take the and go without any rucksacks on the log it was still heavy i mean it was unbelievable and so i was like i did not want to take that thing back to the to the uh, base camp and um sure enough i did but it turned out to be good because I, I was with all the bigger guys and we were there was six of us and so we rotated like every 50 yards we'd switch and so it ended up not being that bad but man there was such a huge difference in the weight of those logs but on the way back it started raining like deep downpour rain lightning you name it our cadre was jc and man he was really chill and cool and just an awesome cadre i couldn't ask for a better one I mean, he worked as hard, but he was just a cool guy. I definitely recommend doing a go ruck. Uh, I did the go ruck light and it was great. I feel much better, like a much better person just for doing it. Uh, it was hard, it wasn't easy. So don't go into a go ruck light thinking it's gonna be easy. Um, there was some guys and uh, that were there that did the tough the night, last night and then slept in their car or something and then woke up and did the go rug light today and um i guess that's maybe a tough light challenge i don't know what they had a word for it but it, i thought that was really cool uh, a lot of great people um good way to meet people and get to know them and um people bond over hard hardship like that so uh sign you up you don't have to have a go ruck bag to do a, a go ruck light event you can just have some sort of bag with weight in it and you can literally get plates of weight and put it in a bag all right so there's no excuse go sign up and do one thanks for watching and i'll see you next time that was pretty tough yes <laughs> well, i've got one of them deals where it, it was tough it, it was tough and even with the water so i wasn't a good runner I was the slowest runner to ever graduate SEAL train. Call me the anchor man. Like <laughs> Come on, we want to see it. Good, 22. Who's going to carry the boats in the logs? That's you, buddy.